Hi everybody and welcome back. I wanted to show everybody this amazing server I found. Its name is Project Lazarus Life. I'm currently on the number one server. Uh, there are a few different Project Lazarus Life servers and I'm playing on number one because it's got the highest pop. Pop is usually about 30 to 50 around this time of day, so pretty good pop. Now let's get started. I'm going to show you what you first should do as soon as you get in here when you're getting used to the server and that's going to be get a job because everyone needs to get a job how else are you going to make money well <laughs> we'll talk about that here in a minute now we've got a couple different things that we can do miner lumberjack diver police taxi and delivery out of all of these you can choose which career you want to go and you can end up switching as many times as you want. But my recommendation for you first starting off is going to be a couple different things. Let's say that you need something to just get you immediate cash. I would recommend delivery driver. It is incredibly boring in my opinion. However, it is really safe for you to do. You are going to drive around the map in a car and then drive it back. That's it. This is not going to be any PVP unless you specifically go near players, which at that point, if you're a delivery driver, you shouldn't really be PVPing too much. The next thing, and this is going to be my first recommendation, is going to be Lumberjack. Becoming a Lumberjack is incredibly easy and even easier than becoming a miner. Now, if you look here, max earning per task is 2,400. As you can see, I've got a tax a task here in Lumberjack, which is 4,000. So this is not actually accurate. It is 2,400 for level one tasks is the max. Keep that in mind. You're probably not going to get that much just starting out. Pretty rare. But shouldn't be too long until you level this up. As you can see, I haven't even leveled this up too much. Just in today, I went from below 15, almost at 20, in about the course of an hour or two. After you reach a certain point, it becomes very easy. Now, when you become a lumberjack, a miner, a diver, taxi driver, delivery driver, or police, it will give you your uniform for the first time. Police do not actually have uniforms or anything like that. They are unable to pick up any items they are just role-playing as police officers. You can arrest people and all their items go bye-bye forever. So keep that in mind. And the best thing that you can do as a police officer is going to be to arrest people because you will get a percentage of their bounty, whatever amount they have. And that can be anywhere from a couple thousand to a couple hundred. So more you level that up, better guns, you will get but in order to make this a little bit easier, I'm going to talk about Lumberjack, because that's what I currently have, and that's the easiest thing I can show you. So when you first start, it's going to give you the kit. This is going to be clothing and the tool. All you're going to do, as you can see, I'm going right down the road. Turn left. Found a bus station right here. And this is going to take me to a logging area. This logging area is going to be a safe zone, so no PvP. Nothing with me leaving and going through any areas where people can actually attack me. It is 100% safe. Make that 90% safe. If you get DC'd, people can and will steal your stuff. Be careful about that, please. If you are actually doing mining, you're going to go to this bus stop down here. And it is not necessarily a safe zone. So keep that in mind. People can kill you after you've left and gone into the mining area. On the map, there is safe mine site B, however, if you're looking at the map. And you can get there from Belksville. One of these bus stops in here is going to end up helping you out getting to the safe mine site B. 
if you need to make it to Belksville, all you're going to do walk through these apartments. So you can see the job site, apartments. You are going to run straight through that door is straight in front of you, me, straight down there is going to be the area to go to Belksville. I'm not going to run down it because it is a little bit of a run. But that is going to get you everything that you need to know about the safe zones, where to farm, what exactly you're risking, and as far as rewards go, the more that you turn in, the more you end up going to get. At a certain point, it's very easy to get 20, 30k in an hour instead of actually just starting. Here you can find armor, clothing, backpacks. If you are just starting out, I would recommend you end up getting a backpack. Not too much of a difference between the regular backpack or the compact backpack. It will also give you these for quests, though. Just to clarify that, it is going to give you them for quests, as in it will give you them for level up rewards free of charge later on. In order to get better tools, I would recommend you come down here. Salvaged Ice Pick and a Salvaged Axe. These are not necessarily going to be as good in some ways, and in other ways, they're going to be better. Salvaged Axe is going to be a little bit slower. However, it is going to give you slightly more wood versus a hatchet. Metal hatchet is what they're going to give you at the start. So keep that in mind. If you need food, this place has medicine and food as well. If you need an ATM, the ATM is right here. I already got the ATM button. You can end up withdrawing any amount that you have inside of your bank. Use it to buy things from the store clerk. All right, everybody, and that's going to be it for this video. If you're having any questions or anything you're trying to figure out, post them inside of the comments. I'd love to help you guys out. Make sure you hit that follow button and that like button to let me know that you like the video and to be able to get more content. Make sure you guys have a good day. And for the question of this video, what's your favorite job in the server? I mean, right now my favorite job is probably being a cop. Just defending raids and things like that, it's definitely the best. Especially since I don't have to risk anything. Catch you next time. Peace out.